I booked my last mammogram with breast screen because I was coming up to my two year review and so I rang them, I think I got a reminder in the post and I rang them and booked an appointment within three weeks I think it was at a time that suited me. I have a very strong history of breast cancer in my family. My mother died of breast cancer um, 23 years ago and my 46 year old sister was diagnosed with breast cancer oh, a few years ago and has had subsequent um, episodes of breast cancer leading to a mastectomy that she had last year. So for me um, it was quite important to take a sort of proactive approach to it and also my sister's breast surgeon told her to contact me and to make sure that I was having yearly mammograms um, from quite an early age. So I started when I was I think about 41 or 42, so it would have been almost nine or ten years ago. So, and that's when I started, and so I've been religiously having one every second year with breast screen. My last mammogram was in January of this year, and it was absolutely fine. I booked an appointment that suited me, and they were great. I turned up, and um, I was offered to go into, they've got a little cubicle, and I went in there and got a gown on my, just kept my bottom half clothing, but got a gown for my top half. And then they took me into the mammography room, and it was absolutely fine. I've had them before, and I thought they were really pleasant, the staff, and um, there wasn't any embarrassment. I, it, it was just great, and, and I have this sort of attitude that, this is a free opportunity that the government's given us and why wouldn't you go and have one done if it's going to save your life? Once I had my mammogram, I think my attitudes changed over the years, waiting for those results. I think when I was younger, waiting for the results to come through, I was a bit, oh, I'll be right. But I think as I've got older and I've talk to so many other people out there who haven't had such fabulous experiences and you listen to it on TV, I'm actually incredibly relieved when I get the letter that says to me everything was clear and I have a deep sigh of relief and I think great I've got another two years. My advice to other women about having a mammogram is be very grateful that you live in a place like Australia where you can go and have a free mammogram taken because I don't think that happens in every country. If it's caught at a really, really early stage, the chances of survival are so much higher. And the earlier you get it, the better it is for everyone. And I just don't think anyone wants to go through the repercussions of finding breast cancer too late.